It is difficult to compare a hurricane with a pineapple express, with the exception of the rain and a lot of it. We're thinking and sending our positive thoughts to our neighbors in the southeast of the country. It was a topic at a meeting of UW climate scientists and state leaders who authored a new Washington climate resilience strategy and point to the record Nooksack flooding of 2021 as an example of how warmer weather has increased rain intensity. Is there a parallel there with what we're talking about in the northwest and what's happening in the southeast? There is. Um, you know, we the oceans are getting warmer. Same thing happening there. Warmer air holds more water. Dr. Crystal Raymond is a UW researcher who helped craft a national assessment of climate change, noting that Florida has been dramatically impacted. But this state has its own issues laid out in the strategic report with the decrease in snowpack and the projected rise in sea levels. It's just a window into the future of when that kind of event, that all those catastrophic consequences are happening more often, right? State climatologist Guillaume Moshe says Milton's impact in the legislatively mandated resilience plan shows the need for action here, from aid for tribal communities to move out of floodplains to building new infrastructure. There are suggestions to address some of them in the next legislative session. I think we do have an opportunity to steer out of the way um, and to reduce those impacts. The events in Florida, a reminder that Washington has its own set of climate concerns just around the bend. In Seattle, Chris Daniels, Como News.